8 a.m. I couldn't fall asleep again Been overthinking all the little things I've said I'm sleep deprived almost every night And I wish that I wouldn't think instead I know the sun is up and I got things to do But I don't think I've got the energy to move And I go back to my dreams again But I shouldn't be sleeping when It's still right now and I'm stuck in my bed Staying in the same bed I need a kickstart just to change this I don't want to waste a minute on the basics But it's keeping me feeling so amazing So I go and stretch Brush my hair, always looking like a mess Oh, and me, I could go and do the rest Give it a little more fit, I'll be set And I hope that you'll miss it I stay that now when it's stuck in my bed Day and night, never feeling my best, I know Welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel if this is your first time on my channel thank you so much for stopping by i really appreciate you for doing that and to all the wonderful people who recently joined my family whoop, whoop, thank you so much welcome to the family and i hope you stay and enjoy every bit of my videos and in today's video i would be sharing a typical work day in my life as a product marketing manager in a funk company yeah but before i go into today's agenda i am going to first of all be introducing myself if this is the first time you're seeing me or this is your first video of me after you joined the family thank you for doing that by the way but my name is Marianne Marianne Okonkwo Abafaro on this channel I make videos about productivity lifestyle and just living my best life and trying to figure out things but also I am Nigerian I am a Nigerian content creator originally based in Minnesota but I'm currently out in Seattle for my internship and it has been an amazing journey I've been learning a lot so I have about four more weeks to wrap up my internship and it's just so crazy how time went by so fast so today I have I don't know if I told you guys because I'm sure I did because I've been carrying you guys along most part of it so what I did was ramp up on all my projects so technically I'm done with my project I'm just cleaning up my deck and adding one last bit of deliverable so my manager found that I was done I mean I told him that I was technically done with my project so he added one bit of deliverable that I'm going to be working on uh, for today or uh, for <laughs> before my final presentation which is happening August 9th but yeah so I'm going to be working on that um, but what I'm doing now with my spare time is networking outside of my project work so I'm meeting people who are in other roles like business planners people in like different orgs outside of my org to get a sense of how their teams are and how their role is um, and outside of that I have two meetings I have this meeting with someone who I see as a mentor so he's actually a year two he just graduated from my school and he has been just so supportive like a, a very strong ally I consider him a great friend so we meet every month so there are two of them that I usually meet every month just because these guys are so chill like you know when somebody's just chill and just so nice so I really want to have them in my network so I asked if I could set up re recurring meetings with them every month just to check in especially during my internship and they were like yeah shoot for it so I did that we'll be meeting every month since I started I think I'm gonna ask if I can keep it so at least I can be checking up on them on a monthly basis to see how they are doing in their new roles but long story short I'm meeting one of them today I actually even forgot until I
until I just opened my calendar. No, I was going through LinkedIn. I saw a familiar name, Emily. I'm like, don't I have a meeting with Emily sometime in late July? So I went to my calendar and surprise, surprise, it was there. I'd already booked my meeting. So just imagine, ah, thank God. So fortunately, I didn't double book myself, even though I forgot about the meeting. So I have that meeting. Then I have another meeting with somebody outside of my company just for networking purposes. And also most of my meetings today are just people in other teams trying to learn about them and their role. I'm going to go ahead and prepare my agenda because I do have two work that I want to do. So one delivery for me this week was to pass my certification exam, which I did. Ah! So your girl is officially Microsoft Power Platform certified. So yeah, I failed the first time. I did it again and I passed this time. So thank God. So once I do that, that one, and I need to clean up like in terms of putting in content so my manager can review them on Friday and then next week I'll just be using it to build out those content. So that's what I'm kind of like doing as delivery. I don't know about work myself because I still have like four more weeks. Well, technically just two more. Let me see <laughs> if I go and jab off. My final presentation is August 9th and before that I have just one week so I'm gonna yeah so the content needs to be there to this week so my manager can review it and then next week I'll just be building out the deck so I could actually just tell him the amplification one I'll work on that next week Monday and I have that ready for Tuesday's meeting and then on Friday we can review the whole deck but I'm gonna share with him so he can pretty much like go through so that's kind of like the plan and since we would not be able to meet on Monday Monday because of my presentation we probably want to do like a very quick touch base on Monday for like a quick reaz I don't know so I think I'll just take that time to work on that stuff so I need to put a mental reminder to let him know that Tuesday I will not be meeting because of the my final presentation but yeah I am so excited I am going to go ahead and start my to-do list I haven't had my bath because I feel like I have a lot to do and days when I have a lot to do and just a couple of hours before my next next meeting i like to just do the meeting first and then during my lunch break go shower so this is pretty much a very realistic and um, most times i do have my bath so don't get me wrong but for now i think i'm going to this is fine i might have to just tie a headband or something on my hair so it looks more nice because right now it's just not giving the right vibe so let's do my to-do list i need to call these guys i feel like i saw an eye appointment that didn't look like what my actual eye appointment i, I feel like i might have clicked a spam email so that has just been giving me anxiety yeah i'm going to call them and confirm because if this is real and it's saying august 17th that is too far so i'm going to call another hospital and see if they have availability for early next week because i just don't understand like two weeks from now it's even three weeks these guys are mental so i don't think this is right so i'm gonna to have to call them but yeah let's go ahead and do my to-do list like always before i do my to-do list i like to open my calendar and see what i have to do for the day and also look at my email so let's pull up my email very quickly not that one you have no idea how excited and how happy i am that i passed my exam okay so today is thursday july 28 just made the list so for the interviews that i'm having with what well, coffee chats that i'm having with five people today six people actually so i want to do a quick linkedin review of their pages and pick something fun or th something i feel we could connect on as icebreaker so i need to do that before my meeting in the next 30 minutes the next thing i need to do is every week i share every friday i share a weekly report on what i've done that week with my manager so i worked on that a little bit yesterday so so I'm going to conclude it and send it across to my manager today. Then I need to also ping each and everybody. So for internship, right, how it works, another very important aspect is getting perspective. So it's called perspective from people that you worked with during your project. So they're supposed to provide feedback on what you've done, um, some areas of improvement and all of that. So my target is to get 10. So far, I've gotten just three. So I need seven more. And I've sent like email. I've like nothing seems to be working. So I 
need to ping them personally to let them know how important it is then i need to call the eye clinic to confirm the appointment remember the stuff that i told you about um i need to also work on my quality guide i worked a little bit on the cover page sent it to my manager he's fine with the current design so i just need to implement it across and start looking for screenshots that i'm going to add to them then for the deck design i am still working on that i feel like this amplification plan i'm going to move it to next week just so i have like i use that next week to just focus on it um but yeah and then i also need to watch the organization video because right now i leveraged my ERT, erg group for the connections that i'm making right now but i want to watch the video where they talked about all the orgs on that cloud marketing and select the people that the team the orgs that i'm interested in and people that I want to meet and then go to who plus so it's essentially like a website intra intranet web where you see everybody and their positions and their role who they report to and all of that good stuff so i need to send all of this as update to my manager today let's do that i am going to take the next couple of minutes the most important one is the linkedin because i literally just have a couple of minutes i need to also tie my hair <laughs> so let me do that i'll be right back so, and this time i try to make it not too tight so this is good let's get started with our day I just finished the LinkedIn research so I just highlighted interesting stuff that I found online things like philanthropy spending three years at the company owning her own her own business the differences between or moving the experience or take from moving from program management to product marketing for those that went through the rotational program asking them how their experiences were i already sent them like an agenda but i just wanted to show that i have taken that additional step to find out more about them so yep this is done i'm just gonna strike that true now my weekly reports will be done at the end of the day but i do need to send my manager an update and let him know this is where things are at yep so let's do that Making good progress. I've been able to knock out a couple of my to-do lists. Right now, I'm currently designing my quality guide. I wish there was a way to change this color to <laughs> the color of this plant to, I don't even know. I just didn't want it to be blank. So I've been looking for an additional like border-like kind of stuff and also trying to call CVS Pharmacy located within Target at 755 Northwest Gilman Boulevard, Issaquah, Washington. If you are a healthcare provider or calling from a doctor's office, press 2 now. Hi, um, my name is Miren Okonkwa. I'm calling to follow up with my prescription pickup that was supposed to be transferred. Okay, so the person that was supposed to meet at 10 is currently out in Paris. So is it Paris or Paris? So I had to move the meeting for next week. So in the next 15 minutes, I have another meeting. I think the day is going well. Email. Hi. Hi, Hi, Emily. I'm good. How are you? Doing well. Thanks for asking. Like a picture. Uh, no, this is from a background. So this is actually Apple Park. Oh, it's so nice. <laughs> yeah sorry I, there, there's not much to see i'm just kind of out inside. no 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 i actually do like it, it looks like a picture <laughs> yeah so if you google pictures of apple park like you'll see bigger like the more comprehensive pictures of it wow um, but yeah again whether it's something that's escalating whether it's a pr plan for hey there's a new feature coming up mm -hmm. you know here's what, how we want to message it here's how we want to talk about it maybe we review a script for the briefing designing my deck my final deck so this is kind of the agenda so i was looking for one that would contain all the agenda that i had because i have a lot of <laughs> stuff but first i'm actually hungry and i just need to make sure that i'm 
me show you guys what I've done so far. So this is what my agenda is looking like. Before this, this was the original one, but you can see that it's just five. And if I made it any smaller, it's gonna be too verbose. So I created this one. Um, and I think I really like this one because yo, it's looking good. One thing I wanna share with you guys is if you're heavy into marketing, you know slides are very important. So this is the slide inspiration website that I usually go to. So I just go to slidesgo.com and I just type in marketing, anything. So, and then it shows you a lot of that. And you just scroll, scroll, scroll and see if there's one that really inspires you, that you like. You can find timeline templates, anything you want, like you will find it. So they have a bunch of them. Some of them are paid for, others are free, but the paid for ones, one thing I like is as you, can you see how I'm just like clicking this and it's moving, yeah? So you can easily just recreate it in PowerPoint if um, you really like it. But, but but there are a bunch of free ones that you literally just copy the slides like this one now it's free so you just copy the slide when you download it so you click here download it copy the slide and paste it and that was what i did with my final deck so i'm gonna go ahead and just go through i'm gonna delete actually, let me copy it first before deleting i'll just <laughs> type it out myself um but i do need to change the fonts to the right fonts because right now they are in arial and the font that we use is the segue ui so i am going to change that font this is how everything is looking i love it i'll see you guys but i also just want to save my battery i need to order food though so let me see so i'm gonna finish up with my day i'm gonna continue with the deck actually i should finish up the quality guide then yeah so you guys i don't know what else to show you guys because it's just a basic boring day but um we're getting through it super tired and hungry if you know the kind of hunger that is doing me eh? i don't think i've eaten since yesterday yesterday what did i eat yeah i had burger yesterday so that's why i'm super hungry i don't know if i should just close my eyes and just order the food it's so expensive i don't want to do that I think I'll, oh i have monster in the fridge <laughs> i can drink that for some energy right Right now i give hand to everybody who knows how to finish a whole can of monster i can't finish it i usually just drink them in pizza and i think i finish it in the spam of three to four days hi this is marianne yes yeah, speaking hi this is kristen calling from issaquah i work how are you doing today oh i'm very well so i was calling earlier to confirm my appointment i got a weird email this morning that changed my appointment to 17th of august so i wasn't yeah no that that's not us I don't know what that was, um, but your appointment is still for August 2nd. Moment to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed to us part to my channel. You guys, the the love and support, especially with my August monthly reset, like it's just surprising. I think I've gained the highest number of subscribers from a video on that video. So thank you so much. If you're joining the family from that video, I love you so, so much. You guys are steadily making my dream a reality. So I wanted to take a moment to celebrate this small win and thank you guys so much um and really just show my appreciation for just clicking the red button and joining the family it's really nice seeing new faces in the comment section so thank you so much welcome 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 let me know if there are very specific videos you want to see on my youtube channel and i will gladly make them i wanted to put that out there right now i know i already alluded to that earlier but i'm almost done with my project right now i'm just cleaning up my deck and making sure that everything is fine but so far i'm really loving the design let me know what you think about it in the comment section i can't really show you the actual content because i don't think that's right but you guys saw like the the design of it on the slide pan so let me know what you think especially about the content table of content page which i should absolutely add the text now so i don't forget 8 a.m i couldn't fall asleep again been overthinking all the little things i've said i'm sleep deprived almost every night and i wish that i wouldn't think instead i know the sun is up and i got things to do but i don't think i've got the energy to move and I go back to my dreams again But I shouldn't be sleeping when It's daylight now and I'm stuck in my bed Daylight now and I'm stuck in my head Cause I've been stressing out all of my home When I should make my way out of my home It's daylight now, gotta open my eyes Daylight now, can't be wasting my time I'm just thinking about what I should be thinking of And it's a 
about time that I get it Hey, stop staying in the same bed I need a kickstart just to change this I don't want to waste a minute on the basics But it's keeping me feeling so amazing So I'm going to stretch Brush my hair, always looking like a I just got back home. I was recording and I didn't realize that it wasn't recording. So I picked up my prescription, got some biscuits from Trader Joe's, got pineapple, then my leftover Chinese rice. I'm going to put it in the fridge. I also got salad that I'm going to eat tomorrow because I'm not about to be spending this amount of money. I just bought small food though that I bought. I spent close to $40. That's including tip. I think I'm already becoming Americanized where <laughs> anything I buy, I tip. So to prevent that uh, self-control, I'm going to be eating indoors now. I'm going to be making my use just I don't have a kitchen. So mostly salad. Now I want to figure out something because girl, I'm not rich. That's a lot of money. <laughs> that is a lot of money. So what I like to do after I'm done with work, just so people know that I'm not available is I put my status to unavailable appear offline so they see that and yeah don't for the thing let me know what you found informative I always try to in every one of my videos to make sure that I am communicating like a key takeaway like today I showed you guys where I normally make how I normally make my um, PowerPoint presentation I also told you guys about how to maintain work-life balance, which is just s simple things like putting yourself, your status on unavailable so people are aware that you're not available. So if you're sending messages, you're not going to reply. So that's one thing that I think has been helping. Let me know what, what you liked about this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. I'm so tired. I'm going to go have my bath because my body, if you see how hot it is, let me actually see the weather. It is so, so hot. 75 degrees or more this feels like 95 degrees in minnesota it's extremely hot you know that kind of lagos heat hot that's like my body is even itching me the, the more the sun touches my body so i'm going to go shower have my bath and i'm going to close all the windows turn off the lights and sleep i forgot to take my vitamins for my eyes so i'm going to do that but of course i'm so tired i don't want to film anymore but i hope you guys enjoyed it i'm so tired and i don't think i have the energy to film anymore and show you guys all of that stuff but yeah that's what i'm going to do have my bath sit down watch a movie i already put a movie on the on the show on the tv but i haven't like started watching it so i'm going to do that uh, tomorrow i don't have a lot of meetings i have my follow-up prk consultation the eye clinic asked me to come back in for an extra examination so i'm going to go for that when i come back i'm gonna continue working try to knock out the whole deck tomorrow so next week monday i'm like relaxing and just making minor feedback and then meeting with my manager on tuesday but yeah that's how everything is going i'm super excited and i can't wait to tell you guys more i love you guys so much and i hope you enjoyed the video you know to like the video leave a comment or even share with your friends and most importantly if this is your first time on my channel i hope you subscribe and join my family i look forward to seeing you i love you guys again stay safe stay blessed kisses